India's mighty Bahubali rocket is poised to make history as the launch of the vehicle Mark III, the LVM-3, ISRO's heavyweight champion, will roar into the eighth mission. This time carrying Bluebird 6, a next-generation communication satellite from US innovator AST Space Mobile. While the goal was to beam broadband straight from space to ordinary smartphones, no special gear required. Well, Bluebird 6 weighs nearly about 6,100 kgs, making it the heaviest payload ever launched by an Indian rocket. Standing at 43.5 meters tall and weighing about 640 tons, the LVM-3, nicknamed Bahubali, is India's most powerful rocket, capable of lifting about 4,200 kgs to GTO and even more to LEO. Important to understand that the missile's mission, in fact, even signals India's entry into the high-stakes commercial launch arena, competing against giants like SpaceX, Ariane X, and in fact, Ross Cosmos for a share of a multi-billion-dollar global market. Well, on this, my colleague Palav joins us on the broadcast for more details. You know, Palav, I, I wish to understand from you, you know, what exactly is the Bahubali rocket or you know the launch vehicle Mark III? The launch vehicle Mark III, which has been nicknamed Bahubali, is standing tall on the launch pad at Sheharikota, ready to lift off with an American communications satellite. This will be the eighth launch of the Bahubali rocket, and it has had a 100% success record till date. Among the notable launches, Bahubali or the launch vehicle Mark III was used for launching India's Chandrayaan-3 satellite, which made global history. This is the third commercial launch of the Bahubali rocket, and this opens many doors. The Bahubali rocket is a 600-plus ton rocket, which is as tall as 43 meters and is India's heavyweight launcher, which is why it has a nickname Bahubali. So the Bahubali rocket, all set to launch an American private sector communication satellite, which is very unique, and then loft it into space, which will be used for giving space-based internet. Right, Palav, you know, also for the benefit of our viewers, help us understand, you know, what exactly is the Bluebird 6 satellite and what exactly is it supposed to do? The Bluebird satellite has been made by an American private sector company, AST Space, and it is a communication satellite. The main purpose of this satellite is to give space-based internet services, broadband in nature, for the world. The unique part of Bluebird is that it will be able to give internet directly from space or satellite to the smartphone or to the handset. The other services like Starlink or OneWeb Utilsat, they have to work through a terminal. Whereas Bluebird's satellite offers this service, which is direct to handset. The Bluebird satellite carries one of the largest phase array antennas which has been carried ever into the low Earth orbit. The Bluebird satellite is a commercial communication satellite and more than three dozen of these satellites, once they are up, then global reach can be there for providing space-based satellite services or internet services direct to the handset. India won the contract against many odds for launching this Bluebird satellite. All right, Pallavan, I also wish to understand from you, you, you know, help us understand what exactly are the larger commercial implications of such a launch. Bluebird 6 new generation satellite, which is being launched by the launch vehicle Mark III or the Bahupali rocket is very unique and it opens many doors for India. It's a commercial launch and this takes now India into a league of nations which can compete in the global launch space market. 
So the Bahubali rocket really opening new doors for commercial space applications for India. But an interesting point is, while the Bluebird satellite will be able to provide space-based internet services for many parts of the world, it will not happen in India. Because in India, space-based internet services are still not permitted. So a landmark launch of a unique American private sector communication satellite to be launched by India's Bahubali rocket from India's spaceport Sriharikota on the coast of Bay of Bengal in Andhra Pradesh. Launch vehicle Mark III as a 100% success record and is also the vehicle which will take India's Kaganyatris to space in times to come. Albert, a human-rated version.